After months of pressure from the Tucson Police Officers Association calling for city leaders to censure one of their own, a new demand has been made by a local political activist group asking the mayor and council to dismiss that censure request. News 4 Tucson's Alexis Burdine joins us live now with the latest details. Alexis. Hey Amanda, in this letter, Las Adelitas, Arizona calls TPOA's request to censure City Councilwoman Lane Santa Cruz a politically motivated attack. Take a listen. In May, Santa Cruz was at a George Floyd related protest in downtown Tucson. I am your city council member that represents. When she was caught on police body cam video putting her hand on an officer's baton. After our report, the Tucson Police Officers Association sent this letter to the mayor and council, calling for city leaders to take action against Santa Cruz, saying in part, her action meets the standard of aggravated assault, a felony. We're told city leaders never responded to TPOA's letter. Now there's another letter, this time backing Santa Cruz's actions. Las Adelita, Arizona sent it out, saying in part, we believe these attacks on the part of the Tucson Police Officers Association toward council member Santa Cruz are an attempt to intimidate, misrepresent, and deflect attention away from Santa Cruz's legitimate concerns and actions. Going on to say, we request the mayor and council dismiss the unwarranted request for censure that council member Santa Cruz's actions be considered aggravated assault. The letter comes with a petition condemning TPOA for what the group calls a politically motivated attack against the councilwoman. It's supported by the Pima County Democratic Party. More than 270 people signed it so far. We reached out to TPOA's president. He says the group has nothing to add at this time. We also reached out to the councilwoman's office and we never heard back. If you want to read the letter in the petition, it's on our website, investigators slash KVOA.com. Investigating for you, Alexis Burdine, News for Tucson. Thank you, Alexis. And if you have a story you'd like for us to look into, email us at investigators at KVOA.com or call our tip line. That is 955-4444.